Hey guys, just want to let you guys know that we now on our store, thebestsauces.com, or you can go to cookingwithjack.com and get to my store. All of our sauces are on sale. Every flavor is on sale, including the seasoning, okay? So today, we're doing a Playing With Your Food episode with Starbucks coffee. I just got regular brewed coffee, okay? I've been told that it's better to order the tall and then the grande and then the vente. It's better to order, it's better value to get a small coffee. I don't see it. I'm gonna calculate it. We're gonna find out how much is in each one, make sure they gave me the right amount. Then we're gonna calculate per ounce for each coffee, okay? And we'll see which one is worth it. All right, just got back from Starbucks, so these coffees are hot. This is a, a tall, it's, they call it a tall. They call this one a grande and a vente. That's small, medium, large to me. I don't know why they ever did that. I have no idea. But uh, probably to mentally think you're getting more than you really are. But the small was 210. The grande is 225. And the vente is 265. So let's measure out the small right now. I'm going to move this out of the way. Put that right over there. We're going to measure out the small and see how much we got. Put the cap there. Stay. All right, here we go. That looks to be about 10 ounces right in that cup. It's now empty, but you get 10 ounces of coffee in the small one, okay? Okay, so before we go to the next one, let's calculate this small right here. 10 ounces, it's 21 cents per ounce, okay? This one costs you 21 cents per ounce. Let's put you off to the side. Here we go. This comes out at 14 ounces. So you got 14 ounces at 225. Let's do the math real quick. 14 ounces. Two dollars twenty-five cents. How much? Sixteen point zero seven. This is sixteen point zero seven per ounce. So so far, this is the better value, right? Yeah. Okay, there it is. The vente. This is the big one. Two sixty-five. So this one is right at 20 ounces and it's uh, 265. This one is 13.25 cents per ounce. All right, just like I thought, the larger one is obviously the better value. This is 13, 16, and 21. Uh, it all depends on how much coffee you want. So let's talk about Starbucks for a few minutes, okay? So some of the things, um, that we do if we're trying to save money at Starbucks is we buy regular coffee there again and again. Then when we build up rewards, we get a fancy $7 drink. So we use our rewards for the expensive drinks. We use our cash for regular coffee. The other thing is if you don't like singeing your lips like I do, it's like nuclear when you get it at Starbucks. Tell them you want it at child's temperature. That should be roughly around 140. 140 is a drinkable temperature. I think they serve it at 190 or above, maybe like two something. But you can tell them what temperature you want your drink at. And I think that's it. So basically, uh, if you're looking for the best value and you love coffee, me personally, I mean, if I drank a lot of coffee, I would get a carrier. I think it's like 13 bucks for a carrier or something like that. Um, I would go with a carrier of cold brew nitro one of those fancy coffees and uh, I would just have it all day. It'd be awesome. So that's it. So you got the prices, you make the decision, decide how much coffee you need and then drink up. Take care.